Hello everybody and welcome back to Dead Cells. We are yet again playing on Roguelike Roulette. This is probably going to be the last episode. I did say that last episode, I know, but let's just have a little fun. We're starting with the sandals, which of course are not great, um, and the bow. I actually quite like this bow. Uh, and let's just get into it, shall we? Oh my god. Oh god, these, these sandals are weird. I've not used these before. I was told a long time ago to never unlock them, and I finally have. That's, that, that odd bit of extra gold there. <laughs> They're actually pretty good, but I mean, I am marking all the targets for the extra damage, so that might be why. <laughs> what it's doing? Not so bad. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> like, with this marking ability, they're actually pretty decent. It's kind of insane how good they are, actually. How did that not hit you, sir? What are you going to give us? Chest? Hey, Tornado with um, increased movement speed is quite nice. I like that. I can get behind it. I can get down with that. You just smack, smack, smack. Oh. I didn't even realize I had the spider thing on then for some reason. Later. 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 <laughs> it works. It's a really good combo. What's this little barnacle thing we can take? I've never actually used this. I've had it unlocked for a really long time. I've never actually used it. Should definitely try using it. Right, let's try and get our 30 kills because I think we actually can. I think we can go from here. We've got a pretty good setup for getting them. Literally just shoot and bonk. Shoot, bonk. We need to be pretty close for it to work effectively, but when it works, it works. So, oh, okay, that's kind of interesting. I like that. I thought it kind of came down and picked them up or something, but apparently not. Let's just go with red, shall we? That's kind of interesting. I like that a lot more than I thought I would. We've got our tornado we haven't used yet as well, so we can use that at some point. Don't go that way. Okay, we've got this room. Still don't really want to do anything to do with that. Let's go up this way. Kind of like this little weird build we got going right now. It's pretty fun. Bonk. No, thank you, sir. Bonk. And bonk. <laughs> Just kick him into the streets. Fuck your chicken strips. Oh, what we're gonna get from this? No, thank you. I will not go against traps while I've still got my streak going. I want to keep my streak. Sadly, it doesn't look like we can get them when they're above, but it kind of makes sense considering the positioning of this whole thing. Bonk. <laughs> oh my god. We'll open this up. This is definitely worthwhile. But what a fun build. What a fun build we've got going on right now. Just absolutely bonking people. I'm kind of loving it. I'm kind of loving it. Bonk. 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 <laughs> it's the, the aura it makes as well is so useful. The aura is really, really nice. We did get a thing here. Bonk. A turkey. Thank you. A little bit of extra HP there. Bonk. A promenade. Now nah, we'll go to the sewer. Oh, should we go to the sewers? I don't know actually. Let's go and let's go and get that that trap weapon thing up here, shall we? Wherever that was. Yeah, it was here. Let me use that bad boy. And I'll take that instead of the barnacle for now, honestly. Probably going to be better for us because we're going for a red build. And yeah, let's, uh, should we go sewers? Yeah, let's do sewers, shall we? Let's do sewers. Go for our 35 kill bonus. Lovely. Lovely. It's been a while since we've got one of those going. Very happy to see it. Roll. No two minute marker, which is fine. We've got ourselves for extra 20 cells. And... Yeah, let's just take this. Getting that early is pretty nice. Head out. 
And yeah, this is going to be pretty good. So, I didn't actually see um, how much extra damage does it do. Uh, max a target, takes damage. If it darks, dies, it marks him and spreads. Okay. I can't believe the Spartan Standals are actually better than I thought they'd be. A lot better than I thought they'd be. Um, won't take anything from you for now. What you got for us? Um, I don't think we really need to reforge anything we've got right now because none of it's really good enough. Uh, let's just go for Frenzy. Frenzy's always nice, and we don't need to restock on any HP, because we are G. We got all we need. And let's just keep pushing through, sandaling the heck out of people, yeeting them as far as we can. <laughs> it's just, it's just such a, like, I don't know how to even say it. It's just such a fun wombo combo. Okay, we've got Turkey there already, which is pretty damn good. Okay, then them little rats are going to be a little harder to deal with, I think. Take my DPS, bitch. <laughs> How'd that not kill you? I just love the way they like poop up into the air and drop down and just die straight away. It's so funny. I don't know why I find it so funny, but it just is. Little bonk and then insta kill. Bonksta kill. Okay, these guys are definitely a pain. So we need to be careful about those. They are pretty easy to kill though, at least. They could just be a bit of a pain the way they move. Just wait for him to get under us. There you go. Okay. Got you with the little kick. The jump kick. Nice. Got him as well. Got him as well. No! You beat. I got caught on one of the enemies, and I got hit again there. I just lost my streak. I did get up to a 30 streak, but I think you need a, I think you need a 60 streak on this floor to get anything, don't you? The little rat got me. Away with you, beast. And you too, foul creature. I haven't used either of my abilities yet, but who needs them? And you're having as good a time as this. Ow. Dive directly onto that there. Oh, we got a legendary here, by the looks of things. Taking a little bit of health damage here. Oh my god, it's so good. Hey, we got a scroll from that guy as well. We do have that turkey back over yonder as well. And we get ourselves a legendary broadsword. I mean, I want it so bad, but at the same time, this is Sandal has been so fun, but we've got to take it though, haven't we? We've got to. I'm sorry, Sandal. You have been very precious for me, but at the same time, that's a, that's what I call a damaging yeet if I've ever seen one. Wait, 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 wait a minute. Victims slow down on our nearby enemies when they die. I love that so much. Roll under the wall, you pendulous man. God damn it. I like to call him a penis, but I don't know. I thought for some reason that was better. Definitely wasn't. It sounded way worse. Ah! Ah! Where's that? Wait a minute. What's, what's up here? What up? Oh, damn, that's pretty, pretty heckin' good. Oh, damn, that's really good. Um, okay. I think we've got what we need already here. I can't remember where that turkey is at all. Oh, that's some chonky hits this, this boy be getting. Honestly, they just die automatically, and the fact that this thing spawns biters as well. Top tier. 
right now. Top tier. I am loving it in literally everywhere. We are getting so many good weapons right now. Leave me alone with all the fantastic weapons game. We'll get some mad HP here. Kind of get, get the habit of doing that, even if we don't see enemies, just fire off an arrow in the distance. I don't even really know what happened there. Okay, the biters are doing a great job for us right now. How are you alive, dude? Look at your HP. No, thank you, sir. I'll be having none of that, thank you. We can go to the ramparts there. We got a focus bomb thing. Where's our turkey? Somewhere around here. What's that as well? Turkey's over this way. Got him. Making the most of it. So we slow them and, like, mark them. Oh, that damage is big. That damage is really, really big. I want to go figure out what that Rams thing is down there. Is it something that I've missed? It's probably going to be something that I've, I've definitely seen and I'm just misremembering. But I'm going to go check it out nonetheless. Excuse me, game. Can you not poison me and lower me from 100% HP so I lose 50% damage, please? That's not nice. Wait, what the hell is this? Okay. What? Where? What even hit me there? What in the fuck? Oh, 1,500 damage. That's what I like to call Big Bada Boom. Probably should have destroyed that for money, but I forgot, didn't I? Uh, ancient sewers. Now nah, we're gonna go for the ramparts. Gonna go take the take the easy street and go ramparts. We've also got a bunch of stuff over this way we should check out too. I'm gonna clear this whole floor. Heck it, let's do it. Oh my god. Get a bit of jewelry going. Teleport me up somewhere. Another firebomb. That's better than the one I have. Why does it. Why can a firebomb even roll deal more damage to frozen enemies? That doesn't even make any sense. Oh, look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Gotta say, this bow. Pretty top tier for me right now. And then we can go to the corrupted prison. Nah, we're playing it safe. We're going ramparts. We're playing it safe, boys. Gotta say. Ah, we could have got the 60. I'm thoroughly enjoying the stuff that we've got going on right now. Thoroughly enjoying. Right. Honestly, I don't want to reroll the modifiers on this because the modifiers are so good. Um, again, I think both of those are too low level to start rerolling stuff on. And... Hmm. Should we go with melee? Um. Let's go with that while they're slowed down. Because we're going to be slowing everything down from our sword. So I think that's a good idea. Um, And the thing is, if you, if you think about this little combo we've got going on here. So... This bow marks enemies um, who then take extra damage for 20 seconds um, and it spreads and then it does extra damage to slow down targets. The ice grenade is going to mean they throw, flow out, thaw out more slowly so they're going to slow down more. And our sword, victims slow down enemies nearby. So it's all going to kind of come together quite nicely with frostbite there and I'll take extra damage. Which I like the sound of quite a bit if you can't understand that already.
It's gonna be very, very nice. I love that noise when you're jumping like rapidly up a thing like that. Oh, hello. Vampirism? That sounds nice. Oh god, yeah, that's really good. That slowdown damage is really nice. It's really noticeable. I didn't know if it was going to be very, like, very much because it's only 42 per second, but that's really, really good. What are you going to give us? Swarm? I don't think that's going to be very good because we've already got an ability to, to gather up biters. And I think being able to gather more is not really going to be coming like, come in handy that often. Oh no, that was so dumb. That was so dumb of me there. Yeah, that's, that's just straight up killing certain enemies. Ah, oh, damn it. I hate it when I accidentally open a door with it. It doesn't really work when I do that. The slowdown is so nice as well, like just in general. This is so good. I'm very, very happy about this build. Especially when we're at full health and we're dealing extra damage. Alright, jump. Get that boy. We'll go down this way. Check out what's going on underground. I can't go that way. Gotta go all the way around this way, apparently. Oh, wait, maybe not. Did I miss something there? Can I go to- oh, I can, yeah. Yeah, I want to go these ways because of things like this. Haven't really been using my, um... Okay, that was kind of bad. But don't worry about it. I haven't really been using my bombs all that much, but to be honest, have we even needed to? Heck no, we haven't. Let's forget what's down here. Is it some sort of secret area or is it just a thing? Excuse me, sir. Look at that. Look how many enemies that took out. And we get pastry for it as well. Back up to full HP. Oh, almost back up to full HP. Not quite. It's too damn good to be true, this run. Too damn good to be true. Don't know how it'll fare against bosses, to be fair. Might not be that good. But for, for, for just mobbing, it's insanely fun. I mean, it's, it's not only just, like, brilliant. It's fun. It's, it's great. Oh, my God. It just works on so many levels. And then we've got the biters with us, like, constantly as well. I'll see you later, buddy. I honestly didn't mean to do that, but I'm happy it happened. I'm sure you aren't. Oh! I always kind of forget the range on this weapon. It's not quite as much as I'd think. Arrow stuck in this enemy. Well, he's dead now. So what you gonna do about it? Give me more red. I need my red. Everything dead. Where you at? Them enemies are just too fast for our broadsword, which is slightly annoying. Whoa, he he pulled the he pulled the sneak on me there. I'm gonna take the green again because that's gonna increase our DPS with our little ice thing we got going on. Any enemy that's low HP just immediately dies. So good. Get rid gets rid of all the pesky boys. Black Bridge, we found it. Yeah, let's just go. 
Let's just go. We could probably find a legendary or something, but let's just carry on. Oh, we did find a recipe, didn't we? Vampirism. Let's have a look. So, nearby enemies bleed and drop a healing item. Item heals 5% HP. Okay. That could be pretty interesting. I'm going to save up what I've got. We've got enough money. Let's just reforge this and try and get um, extra ammo. There you go. That's, that's all I wanted. Three extra ammo for that's really nice. Um, should we go for necromancy or should we go for melee attack slow down enemies? I don't know. We're slowing down enemies in like plenty of other ways. I don't really think we need to. Um, let's just go the usual route and get necromancy. Make sure we're getting enough healing. Probably it'd be better to get us up to maximum HP to get our bonus damage as well anyways, so we'll just go with this build for now. I always like the slowdown builds. Slowdown builds are really fun in this game. The concierge. Right, I don't know how effective this is going to be. Especially when he does that immediately. Really? He did it twice in a row? Can he do that? I didn't know he could do that. I didn't know he was allowed to do that. Bullshit. No! Twice in a row again, dude? Come on now. You know for a fact that's not fair. Oh my god, I, I played that bad. Just power through the damage. Give me all the gold. Give me all the gold. We got the repeater crossbow, which is actually a new one we've got recently, but fine. And I got a tornado, which I'm fine with. Cool. Let's keep going. Stilt village and something sanctuary. Don't know which one we're going to go to, really. I'm not 100% sure. Ah, we missed that by 18 seconds. This is the guy that I want to speak to. Have all of these, boy. Take them all. And there you go. Let's use this bad boy. So let's just go Stilt Village. We've got the big bomb boys, which might be a bit of a, a pain, but I think we should be okay. I'm just thinking these guys are going to be really annoying because we don't have uh, like super long range attacks. Like we have our bow, but our bow is really not for doing DPS at all. Oh, I forgot we got the new crab dudes. The crab dudes can block arrows. It's interesting. Kind of liking the crab dudes. Crab dudes are cool. Not going to lie. Wait, do they just block arrows no matter what? Can they not be hit with arrows? Or is that just like if you shoot them at the, right, at the wrong angle? I'm guessing it's just like a wrong angle thing. Because that would be bullshit if you can't hit them with bows at all. Don't kill my boys. Okay, they aren't too bad, actually. We're making our way through them quite easily. Wow, that's 30 enemies already? Since when, dude? <laughs> when did that happen? How? Okay, no, they can be hit by arrows. It just seems harder. Okay, let's get that up there. I don't know how I killed 30 enemies that quickly. That's actually crazy. I love the noises the crab guys make. It's great. No! 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 Yeah, no thanks, buddy. Let's hope you die to the fire. And of course you do.
I can't even eat that. You ain't hit me yet, boys. You ain't hit me yet. Right. Keep going. Got through our first door. We're through the first gate. Easy bangers on the crabs. Okay, it just seems to be like if you fire at long range, they have trouble. Makes sense. Nice, we've got our 60 enemies. Beautiful. Wasn't even particularly trying to get that, but I'm so glad we did. More red. Oh, the just AoE that we have going on right now is so good. <laughs> It's like you hit one thing, slow everything down, and have a good chance of killing other things. It's so good. Let's get our slow damage. What's our slow damage doing now? 56. That's a pretty big upgrade per, uh, per note, then. I've got a key there as well. And then we've got that wombo combo we just did there to take out the bigger enemies. Like, and then them guys just get absolutely shat on. You're going to give us a legendary symmetrical lance. I mean, yes, but also no. Yes, but also no. We've also got a key back this way too that I don't think we got yet. I see you there, little bloody boy. Everything is dead. Dead, dead. Okay, that's something we don't need to look at. Nice. Got our next key. Through we go. Keep moving on. As far as instincts propped onto the next floor with an 88 streak. Didn't even get hit once. I'm feeling good about that. 88 streak. That's the highest I've ever had. I mean, I know this isn't boss cell one, but still, I'm pretty happy with that. Boomerang, throwing knife, or smoke grenade. Smoke grenade could be interesting. Um... I don't think either of those are that good. Nah, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna take the money. Just gonna take the money. Don't think there's anything we wanna do with this guy yet either. Just everything we've got's just so good. <laughs> I don't really wanna mess with the formula. The formula works. And it works so well. Yeah, I'll take that. Just an upgraded ice bomb. And it's just like, I like having the bombs as our like big kaboom. Can we get up here? Is there something I'm missing? Okay, there you go. I don't know why I couldn't get up there then. Like that guy, like he just died and he dropped a sword. Why are people dropping items now? Is that a new thing? 
I did not see you there, little dudes. Don't worry, though. The chain reaction will get you. When anyone left weak, you will be got to. We're back up to 100% health as well, even after that hit. The pastry. Oh, God. I'll take that pastry back, thank you. Oh, my God. Dudes, just stop moving. <laughs> I can't. Would he hit them? That, that guy needs one of these. Wow, that was annoying. Them little dudes are super difficult to deal with. Also, these big dudes. Die to the fire, dude. You jabroni. Don't want to deal with you. Let's go up this way. Just see if there's anything else up here that we're missing. Doubt it, but we'll, ch we'll check. I activate a teleporter for us. We might end up finding the door up this way as well, so it's worth checking. We're not on boss cell one. Can't open that yet. Oh. Hello. Definitely want that. Definitely want that. Okay, I forgot those guys disappear. He actually died under there. Oh my god, it's so good. It just preps everyone for death. Chest, you hold the whip that we don't want. Again. Stop give, trying to give me that. I've got weapons I like. Oh, that damage. Ah, ah, ah. I did not see that coming. And then jumping down on people's heads as well to get even more damage out of it. So good. Need a slam. What up, shop? Okay, we actually found a good amount up here. We don't need it, but a good amount found. Um, I think we just got to go back down this way, don't we? And go to the left this time. It's quite a far way to drop down, but... The clock tower is always quite a maze to, um, to follow with. Bit of pastry there. Okay, always on those guys. Just use everything we have. Because otherwise they're a pain. Yeah, it's also another thing. It's like a nice alert to when... Uh, like, w when you hear the, the ticking sound of enemies being hurt, it's a nice alert to, like, how many enemies are above you. Or if there is enemies above you, in fact. It's really nice. Oh, yes. The bomb synergy. It's so good. Sadly, it looks like if you actually kill them with the bow, it doesn't count. Which is a little upsetting. So you can't really rely on that. Okay, we've got this room, which we don't have the bell tower key for. Green room here, which I've never, I've never found those any use at all. So I'm not going to bother going through there. And this way here should be the correct way. Also, it's definitely the correct way for at least one thing. Scrolly scrolls. Here it is. That wasn't too bad at all. Wait. I thought we had the key. Do we not have the key? I'm stupid. I thought, for some reason, I was insistent we had the key. Also, we have 73,000 gold. Okay, this way will be to the key. Ah, oh, damn it. Did I get actually hit by that then? I don't think I did, did I? It made the sounds that I did, but I've not lost any HP. Give me that gold in the wall. I suppose if I just built up, like, tons of green. Like, if I had 13 green, I reckon the frostbite would kill most everything. Okay, this is just bad. Stop attacking me. Those dudes are the most annoying. Don't worry, though. We didn't lose too much HP. Another shop.
I find those two d dudes so difficult to dodge. Here's 21 extra cells. Lovely. Up the tower. Get ourselves some more green going. For up probably upwards of 70 damage. Got a little bit of damage taken there. But, for the most part, we good. And in we go. In we go. Cool. Still haven't used that potion yet, which I'm happy about. Doing great for that sort of work. Been able to heal up quite a lot this run. No 60 enemies this floor, sadly. Um, again, again, I'm going to keep saving my uh, cells. Oh wait, uh, do we wanna, do we wanna, well, we, we might as well upgrade this now because we've had it for so long. Yep, that sounds great. Happy with that. Into the clock room, onto the boss. Bosses are kind of where we're weakest, which is a shame because the last boss is really difficult. But we'll see. The timekeeper. Hunt on guard. Let's finish this. Damn it, every time I try and get my last attack on, I can't get it off because he moves. Hey, we got him. We got him. Easy. Didn't even need to heal again. What are potions? You have been bested, fool. Ice bow. Magnet grenades? I'm actually going to take that over our fire bombs. Because I, th I feel like they could be super, super useful. And it'll deal high damage. And it's red still, so. And here's this guy, which we can put another hundred into. Wait, oh, wait. Speak to this dude. Upgrade to plus plus. Yes, yeah, that's what I want. Victims freeze nearby enemies when they die. That's all I was looking for. Lost all my money to it, but that's all I wanted. I'm pretty sure it's the last shop where you get to use anyways, so that's fine. On we go. So from what I remember, the magnet grenades suck everything in, deal damage to everything that they like have within their grasp, attract everything nearby. Does it? From what I remember, the damage is pretty significant. Nice, got you. So anytime we come across a very annoying enemies, like, the, like those big ones that do the spinny attacks, they're the main ones we want to be taking out quickly. Yep, that's significant damage. We almost in insta-killed him. And that reach is pretty far too. Um, let's make sure we get both of our bombs back before we do this elite though. I kind of messed that up a little bit there, but we should be able to get to 100% HP before we fight the boss. Yeah, we're back to 100 already. Bite has finished them off as well. That's the good thing as well. Like, I keep saying about all the different things that are going on here. I keep forgetting to even mention the fact that when we're a little bit off killing something, the biters just do so much to help us out. Oh, God, I lost a lot of HP there. We're going to have to fight him without the 50% damage bonus, but it's okay. We got Malice. Got to be careful. What? He hit me from such a long range. Uh, excuse 
I am I'm gonna die. Just just die, dude. Wow. Okay. That was bad. That that guy that guy maliced us up real bad. Of course, with malice, we're now gonna take extra damage to everyone. Seven thousand damage on a crit when hit when we've got people marked. That's kind of insane. I think the only way to get our malice down as well is to drink our potions. So let's try and drink. This guy can just, like, no. Just, just go away. Just stop. Yeah, we'll try and drink all of our potions before we leave this floor. Okay, I'm, I'm playing bad now. I've gotten scared and I'm playing bad. I'm getting hit by stupid stuff. Getting hit by dumb shit. Dumb, dumb, dumb shit. I don't want to be getting hit by dumb shit, so I better play better. Also, the good thing is as well, we're getting our health up really, really fast here. That's the nice thing about this build too, with the amount of healing we've got going on. The damage that we take doesn't stay around for long. There's no way out of this bit. You kidding me? We've got pastry there as well. I can see that. Thank you. Thank you. Whoa, I didn't realize I had enough range there. Excuse me, sir. Did not realize you had enough range there. You see that old jump he just did then? Little G. I love having all this extra ammo in this thing. <laughs> Absolutely demolished. Just basically one shot that guy. Right, let's use another potion usage here. Get our malice down. Oh, that's our malice gone. Nice one. R rarely have to deal with malice because, like, from what I know, at least on the mode that we're on now, like normal mode, them enemies, the, the, the elites you have to kill for this floor are the only enemies in the game that can give you malice. Like, I've not come across any others that can give you malice. Them guys can just heck off. I don't want to deal with them. More green for Frostbite. It's at 85. Oh my god. Doing so well. Okay, where are we going now then? I'm a little bit lost. I'm going to go down back the way I just came and go down below. Oh my... He pushed me through a trap. Are you kidding me? What a G. That's such a good move for him. He of course didn't mean to, but still. Pretty, pretty smart fella, that guy. Where can we teleport to now then? Come back over to the teleport we're already at, then. Okay, let's, uh... Wait a minute, let's go this way. I didn't notice there was a path down this way before. Try and drop down here. Is there anything of note down here? Probably not, considering. Yeah. A little bit of extra money. Excuse me, stop falling, boy. Then go over to. Can you? Can you just, just like teleport? Damn teleporting! Yeah, you're all dead. The frostbite damage is so strong. Oh my god. This is this got this has to be this frostbite thing here. I don't know about later later game and like when you're playing on the other modes. This has to be one of the strongest combos in the game. I, like it feels incredibly strong. Like the AOE damage potential is insane. Like if you went for um if you went for like the the left claw sickle whatever it's called the new item that's green. That's a really powerful green melee weapon. And then you got it with this ability where it has the freeze on it. Genuinely think 
you wouldn't be able to be stopped. Like, it's so powerful. Another key, another day. Thank you. And it reaches so far as well. Now I'm going to attempt to attack you. Okay, last. This is the last door. Should be able to find our way from this door to the exit. Or a shop. Or a shop. Alright, get that again. I'm just going for so much green because the extra DPS we get is kind of insane. Let's run down to this here. Right, where the hell are we escaping, then? It's got to be down here, right? It's got to be. There you go. We've got all three, so we can go to the last one as well. Get ourselves a little bit of extra money. But I don't think we need. Take that. Cool. On to the throne room. Been a pretty quick run as well, actually. We've kind of gone down a pretty vanilla path, though, I suppose. So that's maybe why. Um, let's just unlock that, shall we? Right, fill up our potion. And onto the boss. I'm still not very confident we can beat the boss just because this build does not lend itself to dealing good damage to bosses. Like, if we can manage to get our third strike off and get the big crits, it's nice, but it's hard to do that. I've been in a really fun run. Really fun run. There goes strike. So that's really nice, being able to sort of insta-take out all of those. Okay, we're not taking as much damage as I felt like we were last time as well. Just saving us a lot. I'll heal up here. Look at that. That's just so good. Oh, damn it. It's really annoying when we miss that. Okay, when we freeze him like that, now that's, that's the big damage right there. We got him. Yes. A nice victory to finish it all off. That was a beautiful, beautiful run. I know it wasn't on boss cell. I wish it was, but my God, do I feel good about that. Holy heck. I feel very good about that. My God. Oh, boy. That was so fun. Just literally like... How how is it that from we we had that same bow from start to finish and it literally carried us that much? It was level one and it just carried the hell out of us. I hope you guys enjoyed. It's probably gonna be the last episode of this series, as I said. Um, but yes, a nice way to finish it off. I'm very very happy about that. And yes, um, again next series, please go into my Discord and we can talk about what we're gonna do for the next one for Roguelike Roulette. And um, yeah, I guess I will see you guys in the next one.